It's been very remiss of me. I haven't even offered you a drink in my lovely garden setting. <laughs> uh, can I offer you a pim? Oh, yes, yes please. How fabulous. <laughs> Is commercial success something that you aspire to or not? Or are you kind of like, oh, no? Or Well, I think it just depends on how you define it for yourself. You know, obviously, we want to be successful. We want to reach people with our music. We want people to connect with it. Um, but it's going to be on our terms. I want to know what love is. Welcome to The Musician Speaks. I'm going to grill you now. You ready? Oh, yeah. Go for it. <laughs> People have been saying that opera is a dying art form since Mozart passed away. Um, the reality is that opera doesn't get the publicity that it deserves. It is accessible. It is modern. It is up to date. And so many of the characters that I sing are the same as you'd find out at Peter Street Station. <laughs> What if you have a preconceived idea and then it goes some other direction, you know? Are you fighting some urge to keep control of your creative ideas? Yeah, you can be a bit precious about certain things and maybe, mm. you know, like, I think if someone is really, really emphatic that that has to stay in there, like, I'm, like that, that part of the song I really love. Mm. I very rarely collaborated with other musicians because I'm a control freak <laughs> uh, <laughs> about everything generally. So Doug is probably best known as a Brazilian guitarist here in Australia, although not from Brazil. No. no? We'll talk from? a little bit more about that later. Yeah, Where yeah. are you from? Williamstown. Williamstown. <laughs> the thing that got me was when you touch the guitars, ever since I was little, you, you remember that feel of the strings and the, the vibration. choice when I was like 12 that I wanted to be a singer and inside that choice I like designed who I was going to be and how it was going to look and ever since that moment I've had commitment and that's where it comes from. It's like a seed. Mm. And it seems like a wonderful sense of fearlessness as well. Yeah, I'm totally fierce. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to say what you think. I already know. I found out from him Now there's just no chance for you and me There'll never be Don't it make you sad about it Let's fall in love, why shouldn't we fall in love? Our hearts are made of it, let's take a chance Are you afraid of it? I seriously feel like the luckiest girl on television having you on my show now, can Probably I the only girl on television Am I? I'm not strictly playing Chopin or recording it or, or, or barking. So in some ways it's like um, taking Hamlet to, 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 to use the same example. 
and creating my own Shakespearean language and sticking it in the original. So if anyone criticises me for that, they can go and get stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Just that, you know, from, from one little person in an orange mesh dress.